GHGC 107. Ball and your name Melvin. What up, guys? It's your man Melvin Taylor. I, I back with another video, and this one is about a short film slash short movie that I was in called The Dinner. Shout out to my man Harry who put this together. So, um, went out, auditioned for this, uh, for this role, got it, and it's long story short, just about um, a couple uh having dinner together and the things that unfold and you kind of see their personalities and what is gonna happen i can't tell you because i'm gonna let you guys see it when this video is over with um i'm just putting this up because like i said in my last video for um nipsey hustle's uh victory lap uh official video um i want to be more intentional about the videos that i put out on this channel and make sure that they're in alignment with more of the things that i'm going to be doing moving into the future and some of those will be uh acting occasionally aside from just doing reaction videos don't worry y'all still gonna get those because y'all know i love to do that but i'm also going to be growing and expanding in terms of the original content that you guys will see on this channel and this is a part of it so um i'm gonna, I'm gonna actually take y'all through the day a little bit as i got a few ig videos um that i still have on my phone from this was like early last year so it was some time ago but um, I got a few IG videos on there that I can definitely uh, share with you guys so y'all can just kind of see a little bit of the fun that we had on set uh, before you actually get to see the um, the film. So let's check those out and then I'll hop back in with you guys and then just give y'all a bit more context before we go into it. Ladies and gentlemen, this man is a champ, okay? You guys gotta understand what he's going through today to make sure that this sound comes out perfect. You are the man, don't forget that. Thank you. The thing you want to say to the people? The last batch of <laughs> So now that y'all have seen those, uh, prepare for the full feature length. It ain't really feature length, kind of like. We, I'm, I'm thinking it's like five and a half minutes. Well, we gonna entertain you, bro. Don't even worry about it. But um, it's me, uh, a friend of mine now named Avery, who is the actress uh, who's playing my girlfriend in this in this movie. And uh, the waiter is actually my man Harry, who who wrote the script. Um, it was a lot of fun to be able to do it. It was kind of like out of the box, in a sense, because I hadn't really uh, done anything. Um, I, I, actually, that's that's kind of a lie. I did do a little bit of acting stuff beforehand, but I can't tell y'all about that just yet. Y'all gonna be seeing that soon, though. But um, uh, uh, um, um, it was just a lot of fun to be able to put it together because uh, Harry allowed me and Avery to kind of improvise certain lines uh, throughout throughout the the. the <laughs> Why I keep talking like it's a full length film, bro? Throughout the film, um, it was just really dope to be able to be like, okay, like. Now that I'm in the mindset of this character and I'm in this space and I'm this person, um, this is what I think this guy would say versus what we have here or what it is that was portrayed um, through the script. Man, it was a lot of fun. Like, not even gonna hold you, bro. It was it was so much fun. I, I can't wait to do some more of that this year because we definitely put that out there. 2019, you know, we got to make sure that we, we, we following our dreams, we're doing everything that we want to do and we being intentional um, and forth going about the things that we want to do, you know, um, so, yeah, damn, I thought I had so much more that I wanted to say that, um, that's, that's kind of it at this point, man, um, I just hope that this can be the start of something great, and who knows, man, maybe one day I'll be coming back to y'all being like, yo, remember that day when I dropped this first like short film on YouTube. Well, guess what? We got a full length movie now right here on my YouTube channel. We gonna build up to that. You know, y'all, 
y'all, y'all and me, we gonna build up to that. Y'all stick with your boy, and your boy got y'all. All right, but for now, um, without further ado, I just want to thank you guys so much for uh, for um, sticking with me through all of this and being a part of this channel. So please make sure that you subscribe to the channel, so that way you can get some more of the videos that I will put out relatively soon. All right, guys, thank you so much, and um, here is the dinner. And before I go. Stay blessed, stay favored, always stay tailored. Press subscribe, and I hope that y'all enjoy. Let me know down in the comments below what you think. Peace. Hi, Mr. Nick. Everything is well prepared. Do you need anything else? Uh, I think it's good enough. Great, enjoy your dinner. Thank you. Where are my rings? Here it is. Yeah, I'll be sure to break up with him completely this time, babe. Don't worry. Wait, I'm getting in the elevator. Bye. Hey, baby. There you are. Hey. Sorry, I got here as soon as I could. It's okay. I've already ordered your food for you. What did you order? Pork chop and chocolate pudding for me, and your favorite roasted Alaskan cod with green tea ice cream for dessert. Always pork chops. Yeah, they make it different at different restaurants. Okay. So, how was your day? Fine. We had an emergency meeting with the factory rep. The last batch of product was completely unqualified. Why? What's wrong? Simple mistakes. And now we're thinking about... Never mind. It's the same shitty problems every day. I heard they have a new course. It's called Raised Halibut. Sounds good. Remember when we first came here and there weren't that many courses? My boss is going crazy. After our meeting, he asked me to get a Valentine's Day gift for his wife, and I asked him what would she like, and he was like, I don't know, that's your job to figure out. I know, I was like, what the fuck? I've never met her, I don't know what she would like. That's sad. Yeah, I've never met her, and then he just left, and went to some stupid conference in LA. How about a bunch of roses? No, that's cheesy. And I think she's allergic to pollen. I was thinking about getting her a cake from Lady M or Harp since that's what I would like. But actually, I don't even know how old she is. Maybe like 36, like my boss. No, Doris met her before I came to the company. But I don't know if her number would still be in the office phone book. Nate, what are you looking at? Um, nothing. Bullshit, you were looking at something. What's going on back there? Is that Kaylee? Your ex-girlfriend? Listen, it's not that big of a deal. I love you and I want to spend the rest of my life with you, okay? Seriously? What is she doing here? It's just a coincidence. Can we just forget about it? Come on, how could you still keep in contact with her? Can we just stop talking about it? I'm sorry, okay? What? Also, can you stop talking about the shitty things from work? What's wrong with you? You're off the job right now, and you're having dinner with me. Are you trying to change the subject? Do you know what's so special about today? What, just tell me. It's not my birthday. It's not your birthday. It's our anniversary. Oh. 
Well, you still can't take your eyes off your ex-girlfriend. Please, Joanna, I, I'm sorry, okay? I just want to have a great dinner with you, babe. Don't call me that. I'm not your babe. I'm tired of being your babe. What's the big deal, Joan? Are you serious? I just think we need to take some time to cool down and think about this. Why? What's wrong? I'm not the one you fell in love with. Fuck you, Nate. Enjoy your dinner. I hope you spend the rest of your life with your pork chops. With G H G C one oh seven, ball your name Melvin.